<laughs> so my trip to Akumakan in Galway with Tantalus didn't go quite as planned. My train to take me to Dublin to meet up with the others ended up arriving at the platform roughly 10 minutes late. <laughs> and got in to Houston Station roughly 15 minutes late. So I got to see the connecting train leave and had to wait two hours for another train. However, the train the others took got stuck for an hour on the tracks. So I was only an hour behind them. Because of complications with various events throughout the convention, our rehearsal times were sporadic. So we spend a lot of time just waiting backstage to hear about when we get to do our tech rehearsal. <laughs> that was just as I hit record. That's <laughs> so uncivilized, Archie. Shut up. You're embarrassing me. Shut up. Do it again. <laughs> <laughs> I had to deal with this before. Did you, did, did the little flavor marble like shoot out of that? Did you swallow it? No. It doesn't smell right. I think every bottle of that Yeah, but you're like a water guy, right? So it's fine. Yeah, it's fine. Yeah, okay. I'm going to wrestle. No one wants to swallow the flavor Don't marble. Russell, every beverage you see. Russell, have some dignity. So, so, Connor, how is Akumacon going so far? I'm covering ramen. <laughs> and I'm very Obviously, tired. This is the voice of God. God? <laughs> you Hello? Pay for your sins. It's me. I know I will. Is it me? We all pay in some way. So, this is the face of God. How's it going? I'm, I'm responsible for everything. And uh, I get off to it. This is who you can blame yeah. for Donald Trump. I mean... Wow. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not going to deny that. <laughs> Seems like a good idea to tell I'll be honest. Here, there, it's me, spring, running, there, it's like, huh? <laughs> <laughs> and we've got like small part of Rainbow Rocket. Actually, yeah, it was a good boy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Although I didn't agree to work with him, I wasn't aware. Of that. <laughs> you think I'm going to wrestle you. Do you think a ball like this could kill me? Can you say no? It would just put you in extreme oh. pain. So pretty much like the rest of your life. And I didn't get to do as much vlogging as I'd like. I also didn't get to interview the guys from the Mans of Action panel like I'd been planning. Our schedules just did not line up at all. But I did get some footage from the panel, so hey, take a look, I guess. But the rain is starting to get through my light jacket and soak my clothes, so whatever, I go in. <laughs> I land in a tiny little landing with a sign telling me to press the buzzer on the wall. I do. And after a few seconds, an elderly lady opens the door and motions me in. She speaks very little English. <laughs> And she grabs a towel and hands it to me. I thank her and begin drying off, apparently not to her satisfaction, as she takes a towel and begins to dry me off. <laughs> a pretty uncomfortable experience. I look young for my age, and she asks how old I am. I say, 21. <laughs> And I can see the disbelief and note her drying me off is pretty belittling. But I'm used to that kind of thing. 
kind of stuff, so I brush it off. She leads me back to the massage room and I ask if I can use the restroom before it starts. She points me to a small restroom at the end of the hall. I'll spare that part, but I notice there's this room, toothbrushes, Vaseline, etc. in the bathroom. By now I'm positive. This place does happy ending type stuff. <laughs> The first performance went off pretty well. There was a, a couple of minor technical problems because, well, we'd only gotten to do one tech rehearsal. So, of course. The next day, though, the roof leaked. And this being Ireland, the building supervisor lads said, Asher is fine. And so we did the performance anyway with a leaking roof. I don't know if you can even see this. I don't know if my camera's picking it up. But the roof is leaking. What with all of the uh, expensive lighting rigs and everything. This trip is cursed. And then, immediately after the show, I ran. I ran back to the train station as fast as I could and took a train. And on the train was when I got the phone call from my brother telling me our grandfather had died. So yeah, that wasn't, that wasn't really according to plan at all. This vlog is sporadic and depressing and just, yeah. Next vlog will be happier, I guess. I don't know. I'm not good at vlogging. I'm just not. I'm sorry. <laughs>